everyone welcome back to the channel please make sure you like and share the video subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed I hope everybody's December is starting out on a great foot I know there are a lot of Capricorns shout out to the caps including me of course gotta throw that in there my birthday is December 29th yes yes a few days after Christmas and of course like a lot of people who have babies around that time of the year they kind of be hoping maybe the baby will be born on Christmas maybe the baby will be born on New Year's but I was born right in the middle but anyway you guys I am doing this video today um, December 1st 2021 first of many vlogmas videos that I'm going to be doing this month this is vlogmas day one and what I'm going to do today is stroll well not stroll cruise we're gonna cruise through some areas of my city of Omaha Nebraska to look at some Christmas lights can you see them from here can you let me zoom can you see the lights in the distance you guys not the car lights y'all not the car lights but like look to the top left of the screen you see like the lights in the trees it is so beautiful down here y'all it's really really beautiful and i want you guys to see how we do it in our neck of the woods in north omaha nebraska which is the, predominantly the african-american section of omaha nebraska north omaha um, to be more exact, which is where I'm from, born and raised, child, born and raised in the streets of North Omaha, Nebraska. So, now you can get a little bit closer look at the lights. Look at that beautiful trees right there. Oh, wow. I'm about to go around some corners. Um, you can see from the top of the screen on the right, I am on 24th Street. 24th and Lake Street, North 24th and Lake Street. And I am going to turn around so you guys can get a good visual of all these beautiful Christmas lights. Okay, here we go. Trying to drive slow without stopping traffic. Beautiful, beautiful lights on both sides of the street. I just love it. I just love it. I just love Christmas time and the lights. I know some of y'all was giving me shade. Y'all was giving me grief because I put my Christmas decorations up the day after Halloween. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. I ain't gonna lie. I did put my... It was October 31st um, on a Sunday. And the very next day was Monday. And I told my son early in the morning. <laughs> I said, remember you were gonna help me uh, decorate the house right after Halloween? And he was like, Mom. I did not think you were serious. I did not think you were serious. But I love lights. Yes, I love lights. It's something about lights that I wish I could have year round all over my house. Like all over my house. And I know if I did that, whew, the bill is gonna be high. The bill is gonna be high. So of course I can't do that. And then my neighbors might be complaining because I got all these Christmas lights up all year round. But yes, we just throw drove through a uh well-known area in North Omaha, Nebraska, which is 24th Street, right off of Lake Street, to view the lights there that they had up in the beautiful trees. Now I'm gonna take you to another area that I really love to go to every year, every year. There are some beautiful lights here too, so I definitely want you guys to check them out. 
And of course, let me know. Let me know if you're going to participate in Vlogmas this year. Now, Vlogmas, as you know, is like before Christmas. So it's like 24 days um, before Christmas, basically. And you are supposed to do a vlog, which is a video, not a blog, no typing. I mean, you can if you want. Because I do have a website, www.thehoodtable.com, by the way. For those who might be interested. But, <laughs> anyway, anyway, let's see, which way should I go? Which way should I go? I think I'll go up Cumming Street. Cumming Street is near downtown. And I am heading not downtown, but a little bit up from downtown. We are heading towards Turner Park which is a very beautiful park right in the midtown of Omaha, Nebraska. It's not far from downtown. They call it Midtown. And they have a beautiful park there called Turner Park. And in the summertime, in the summertime for like, I think maybe a month or maybe maybe six weeks through the summertime, they have what we call their Jazz on the Green. And Jazz on the Green is where... They uh, invite all type of musicians from near and far. And they play some very beautiful music all summer long. You go, get your children, get your family, get your girls, get your guys. And you basically just go with your uh, cooler, have you some drinks, some water, some snacks, some fruits. You know, grab you a picnic blanket make you like some stuff for a picnic then you hightail it over with your uh, lawn chairs over to Turner Park and it's usually every Thursday every Thursday and I believe it starts at like 7 o'clock but most people try to get there by like 5 or 6 to get a good spot but yeah they be really having some really good jazz in the summertime all kind of different bands and artists and people like that and i must say that this summer i really didn't partake in the activities up there um still because it was you know we still in this cbd 19 season and i'm still a little paranoid when it comes to being around humongous crowds so that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. Heck, I just started going back to church like a couple of months ago, okay? I was like tuning in to church from the internet uh, because our church goes live every uh, Sunday and um, a few other days a week they go live too. But back to Christmas, y'all. We are coming around the corner to Turner Park. You can see the lights already. It's a park full of beautiful lights all over the trees all over the trees you can see the trees to the right there's a whole lot of them I don't know how many trees it is but it's a whole lot of trees Just beautiful. Look at all the trees, all the lights. And the trees go all the way up the block and we are gonna drive up the street just to get a good look at them too. They did decorated all the poles and everything in the Midtown area.
it gotta be probably about maybe 50 trees out here yeah approximately probably about 50 trees out here and I just love it it just makes for a nice nice night out to a nice walk especially like tonight you guys because it's really nice out here the weather is not cold at all at least not to my standards but yeah as you can see they decorated up the street as well the poles and the lights I mean the poles and the trees so we're gonna drive up and cruise up all righty we're back in the car and we're taking a cruise drive slow drive slow I'm so glad it's not a lot of traffic tonight because I really don't want to irritate people because I'm trying to take in the scenery. I'm really trying to take in the scenery, you guys. So I'm really glad it's not a lot of traffic down here tonight. Blocks and blocks and blocks of beautiful lights. There's some more trees over there to the side. Actually, on both sides. A lot more trees. As you can see. And what I'm actually going to do and I'm going to circle back around so I can go to the other side of the park. Because for one, I was actually on the uh, south side of the park. So I want to take you on the north side of the park so we can look south. Just to give you a different angle to look at. But we is catching these lights, child. But yes, please, you guys, let me know again. Please let, yes, please let me know again. If you are going to be participating in Vlogmas, I think Vlogmas is so important for those who do not, um, I just think, well, you know, I just think Vlogmas, I can't even say it right. I think Vlogmas is very important, especially for those who are vloggers, who are social media uh, content creators, because we kind of, with these videos, we're kind of like helping pe other people, you know, get in the Christmas spirit. We're kind of really helping others get into the Christmas spirit. And also not on not just that, but it's also a lot of content that you could do around the holiday season. There's so many different things that we could talk about around the holiday season. From being with family, being with friends, caring, sharing, giving, being appreciative of every little thing that you have positive in your life. And this, you guys, this is looking south from the north side of the park. Just beautiful. Let me zoom in a little. I have my window down in my car so that you guys can get a better view. Got people out here walking their pets. Yeah, this is a really nice park. A really nice park to have a picnic at. A really nice park to take a stroll, walk your pets, bring your children to. And I just wanted to show you a piece of how our city um, handles their decorating around Christmas time. Around the holiday times. 
So please feel free, you guys. Please feel free to upload some videos, some Vlogmas videos. Remember, we got like 24 days now. So today should be your Vlogmas day one. And you don't have to even like go out and record something. You can always just come on, jump on your uh, computer, jump on your laptop, jump on your phone, and just talk about Christmas. That's what Vlogmas is about. It's about making Christmas videos all the way up until Christmas time. So you got 24 days. If y'all haven't got started, you still got time before midnight to make your Vlogmas day one video, you guys. And on that note, you guys, I want to wish you all happy holidays. I really, really do want to wish you all happy holidays. I hope your entire holiday, holiday season bring you nothing but blessings. Nothing but blessings, positivity, peace, happiness, joy, positivity, many fruitful blessings many blessings many blessings over this holiday season and on that note you guys please again make sure you like and share the video subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed please and thank you very much stay safe be blessed remain vigilant and once again happy holidays